commonly used high viscosity mixers, the vertical change can type of mixers. So here, as you can see in the image to the right, there is a mixer assembly and there is a bowl which can be removed. It's called a change can mixer because you can you know, get after mixing is completed, just move the can out and uh, you know, take it for further processing while the same mixer can be used to mix the next batch while the first one is being unloaded, discharged or processed. So what are the advantages of having a change can mixer? Well, the weighing of material can be accurately done. The cleaning of mixing vessel is easier, thereby resulting in less batch to batch contamination. Cleanability is an important consideration when it comes to food applications. The packing glands seals do not come in contact with the material, thereby eliminating product contamination. So because it's a vertical mixer configuration, the process material or the food material will not come in contact with the seal areas of the mixing elements. So that eliminates product contamination. As we discussed, we could have multiple cans and they can be used to enhance the productivity without any downtime during the material discharge or charging. Because of the vertical configuration, these mixers can be operated at as low as 10% of the desired working capacity. So the operating range here is good. Uh, just like we had in a vertical cone blender, you could you know, operate from 10 to 100%. The same is the case for uh, change can mixers, most change can mixers. And discharge of highly viscous materials from mixing vessel can be achieved by locating the vessel on a separate hydraulically operated discharge system. So you could be handling materials which are extremely viscous, you know, viscosity to the tune of a few million centipoise where the material will not get discharged by the action of gravity or just by the push of the mixing blade. In such cases, you need additional devices which are hydraulically operated. These are called uh, discharge systems and they can be used to discharge the material.